and a very warm welcome to Bharata First Time Frank Rausen Pereira. This is FRP Explains. It's all a big game for the rich. Just because they have money, they feel that they can get away with anything. And we are their guinea pigs. Bill Gates is trying to play God. And he's been trying to do it for some time now. A company funded by Bill Gates based out of England called Oxitec has released 150,000 genetically engineered mosquitoes in the United States. It was not released there first. Trial runs were held in countries like Brazil, Panama and the Cayman Islands and then finally released in the United States in Florida. 150,000 male mosquitoes have been released in Florida's Keys area to mate and breed with the Aegis aegypti female mosquitoes in the wild and these mosquitoes, these male mosquitoes will then insert a gene into the female mosquitoes and when the offspring arrive at the larva stage itself, this gene will go and kill the female versions of the mosquito and the males will continue to survive and thrive who will then pass on this gene to other female mosquitoes. So even in mosquitoes, female feticide is something that we are practicing. So unfortunate, isn't it? So these genetically engineered mosquitoes have been introduced into the wild to get rid of these Aegis aegypti female mosquitoes who are about 4% of the population in that particular region. But it is said that they cause all the mosquito diseases, especially dengue and malaria. And the United States wants to get rid of dengue and malaria. And that's why they have decided to implant these mosquitoes there. Clearly, it's not a good move. Clearly, it's not something that will work out. Maybe in the short term, they believe that it will cause some kind of relief. But in the long term, there could be catastrophic effects. History has shown us that nothing good comes out of playing with nature or messing with nature. Our scriptures talk about it. They talk about how we need to respect nature, how we need to be one with nature and how we need to have some kind of a balance in nature. Even the Chinese talk about it, the yin and yang concept. But somehow we don't seem to be understanding this. The sooner we do it, the better it is for mankind. Even several movies have shown us that nothing good comes out of messing with nature. Jurassic Park is one such example where we've seen how the dinosaurs wreak havoc really. Of course, it's a movie, but even in real life, it's the case. You look at BT Cotton and the kind of pests, super pests that it has created, all because the cotton was genetically modified and genetically engineered. The desi variety of this cotton did not have this, these kind of problems earlier. But no, we won't learn. We will only accept what the West is giving us and then think that it's the best and then in turn ensure that it damages us as a whole. The rich need to stop playing these games and we cannot continue to be their guinea pigs. We have to ensure that we stand up to them and this can't go on forever. This is just a game. Bill Gates is fed up with Microsoft. So now it's a new project. And it's a more dangerous project, something that we need to watch out for. Once again, the bottom line is you do not play God and you do not mess with nature because nature has its own way of coming back and giving it back to you. And remember, karma and payback can hurt you really, really hard. You look at all that's happening around us. Look at the kind of devastation the Wuhan virus has caused. Of course, the jury is not out still, but there are several people around the world who believe that it was indeed a lab experiment that went wrong. The Brazilian president has gone so far as to call it biological warfare. I'm reiterating the jury is still not out really as far as whether it was man-made or whether it was natural, we'll have to wait for that at some point in time. Maybe we will never know the answer as well. But still, we need to be careful when we play around with nature. Well, that's it on this edition of FRP Explains. If you like the content, please like the video, subscribe and then hit the bell icon. 
For those of you who would like to come forward and contribute to keep this content alive, you may do so by using the UPI IDs. A small contribution that you make will go a long way in us bringing you this content. That's it from me. See you again next time. Thank you.